What in the world is this? I told you to stay away! Oh my god! <laughs> All right, guys, I am in Champlain Mall right now. Champlain Center, I think it's called, in Plattsburgh, New York. And look what is right in front of me. I am so excited. I'm just about to go off. After all this waiting, there is a spirit Halloween that is open. Holy crap, I think I'm gonna hyperventilate. Look at the ginormous sign. This is one of the coolest spirit Halloweens I have ever seen. <laughs> look at this. So, these are like gigantic logs out here, because everything is like that Adirondack uh, the uh, theme or whatever you wanna call it call it out here. So cool. I cannot wait to go in. Look at this. How cool is this? They even have these ginormous spirit like stickers on the logs outside the store. This is so cool. All right, let's go in and oh my gosh, they have like next to nothing set up. All right, it's still gonna be cool. We're still gonna make a good video. Hold on, let's check this out. I am excited though to see that they do have Mr. Howell set up. So let's get him going here because he's one of the awesome ones. Look at this. I cannot get over how enormous he is. And look how huge his hands are, look. My hands barely even go past his wrists. Oh my gosh, he's so enormous. Look at the teeth on him and the light up eyes. That is so cool. One more time because I can't stand it. Here we go. <laughs> he rears up and howls like there's no tomorrow. You gotta love Mr. Howell. Oh my gosh, look at the size of his feet. Holy crap, those gotta be size 52s. Mr. Howell, you certainly do have some ginormous feet. Even though there's not many set up, I do see that we have the Hauntress. Okay, come out, scare me, do it. Do what you will. Oh, there he is. <laughs> the Hauntress, I called him a he, but I think she's a she. Tell me if I'm right or wrong. Is she a she or is he a he? Excuse me, sir, ma'am, are you a he or a she? I couldn't understand that. I don't speak ghoul. Okay, we are still gonna go through and experience the chains of death. Here we go. And this is something I missed before. The floor is like lava. The floor is lava. It's pretty cool. Okay, is it gonna scream? Is it gonna flash? We got some flashing going on up here. We don't have any fog. I don't remember if there was fog in the last store or not, but there was no screaming. What the heck? Let's go through one more time the chains of death. Will you try to kill me, chains of death? I guess not. Okay, yeah, unfortunately we don't have any of the animatronics set up right here, but we do have the evil chunks of death, whatever those are. And look, we do have a Mr. Howell. I believe he's for sale and available right now. Okay, I can hear you, Mr. Howell. All right, well, this is where Buzzsaw will be right here. Mr. Huge with a spinning Buzzsaw hand. Oh, look, we got a Nightcrawler in the box. Pretty cool. We got a Harvester of Souls over here. Pretty cool again. And over on this side, even though we don't have anybody set up yet, we do have the Pumpkin Carvomatic. Look at this, you gotta love this thing. The workers, the Grimms, are all standing back here just watching the pumpkins go through. And as they go through the Carvomatic, they get automatically carved. And look at Mr. Grimm, he's so bored, he's like, um, I could carve these myself. Watch, he'll roll his eyes. Watch. <laughs> Look, he rolls his eyes like, oh my God, you have to have a carve -a I could just do this myself, guys. And I gotta agree with him. The carve -a is cool, but don't you wanna carve the pumpkins yourself? Okay, guys, we are gonna take a walk around here real quick. I hear, where in the heck is he? I hear the Harvester of Souls, but I don't see him anywhere. Do you guys hear that? What in the world? Oh, okay, over here, here we go. There he is. He's all set up and ready to roll, as well as Wacky Mole. Wacky Mole and ready to roll. <laughs> Harvester, your new name is ready to roll. All right, let's... Look at me, just as all the others have. Now that I have you, your soul will be mine forever. Okay, no fog, but you can see the fan in his mouth is going. Wow. 
That is seriously one of the loudest harvesters I have encountered, even out of last year, guys. That was so loud right there. <laughs> All right, let's check out Wacky Mole. He's moving. Hi, Wacky. You know, you don't really look like a mole, but you certainly are wacky. Wacky mole and ready to roll. <laughs> and it looks like this spider is already spent. He's already in the jumped up position. So, hello, Mr. Spider. Maybe one day you'll get back to normal. All right, something else I have to check out because a lot of people keep on telling me. Right here, the location of what would be Mr. Dark. And you can see that he is not here, but a lot of people keep telling me that if I looked behind him, there's a clipboard that gives away next year's theme. Now, I don't know if that means that it's like part of the setup here or what the deal is. So let's just take a little peek here for a second. Crazy clown mask trick or treat carved in chest. Okay, I don't see any secret drawings on here or anything, so I don't know. I don't know what you guys are talking about, but if I find another store that actually has Mr. Dark set up, I will look again. Mr. Skeleton, you need to sit a little bit better right here so the children can put their head on yours. And I do need to put some stickers in the box for any young children coming to find them. Holy crap, guys, look at this. A psycho jack-o'-lantern big mouth mask. I don't know if I have ever seen this guy before in my life, but he looks so cool. Look at that, huge mouth, and I bet you anything, it's one of those that when you put it on your chin goes somewhere in here, yeah, and can actually move the big psycho mouth with the pumpkin. That is an awesome mask right there. I love that. And I'm seeing a lot of things that I have not seen in stores before, guys. But before we get to them, let's look at the animatronics that they actually have for sale on the floor here. Okay, look at this. We've got a whole slew of sitting scarecrows here. $160 each, and there's two, four, there's six of them. Six sitting scarecrows. That's one of my favorite right there because he's so scary and jumps at you. We got a Hauntress here. On the other side, we've got a Sam. Let's check him out. Here he is. Okay. All right, let's keep on going here. And we don't have anything set up here either, but that's okay, that's okay. Posable dunny, dummy prop here. Dunny. You guys know what a dunny is? It's a toilet. It's a freaking toilet in Australia. I am cracked. Okay, I do not see any more on this side but we're gonna keep on looking, so hold on a minute. Okay, wait, we do have Sam set up over here, so I don't wanna pass him up. Hello, Sam. <laughs> I love your lollipop. Gotta love Sam. Okay, all right, we don't have the uh, the clown over here, the shorty clown, but we do have a shorty mask. That is actually pretty cool. Look, we also got a spiky mask. That is awesome. Holy crap, totally cool. All this killer clowns from outer space stuff here. Here's the costumes up here. A shorty costume if you wanna be shorty. Here he is. And then we got Jumbo over here. But I don't see a jumbo mask anywhere. But they could just not have it set up yet. I'm just glad they were gracious enough to open with what they do have set up because it lets us come in here and enjoy our favorite time of the year. Hello, Steve. Okay, here's a whole giant stack of jumping spiders. It looks like, it looks like they're all, oh, okay. Bunch of them are brown. They got some black ones in there. Are, is this the red one? Yeah, black and red one here, black and red black and brown. Okay guys, I do not see any other animatronics other than everything that I have just showed you, but this is one of the cool things that I see right now in this store that I have never seen in one of these stores before, so maybe it's new for this year. Plush Beetlejuice characters. Look at this. What in the heck? That is the coolest thing I've ever seen. I love it so much. And then here's uh, the husband. I can't think of his name right now because I'm so excited. <laughs> Remember how he pushes his hand up through his head? These are the funniest things I've ever seen. Look at the eyeballs on his fingers. That is hilarious. 
Oh my gosh, if I was a collector, guys, I would just, I would just buy the whole store. <laughs> And look at this mug. The mug is the handbook for the recently deceased. That is hilarious. I love that. This is a sweet trick-or-treat sign right here. Poison, drowning, claw, or knife. So many ways to take a life. What the heck? What is wrong with us loving Halloween so much? This is a days till Halloween like a counter. Okay, so let's look at the back here. Um, oh, okay, I see. Here's the wheel right here on the side. And you turn it to change how many days are left till Halloween. That's pretty cool. And this right here is one of my favorite Michael Myers things that they have in these stores, guys. Let's see if it works. Oh, look at that. The pumpkin lights up. So cool. Oh my gosh, I love it so much, guys. One, two, three, they have four of them. How much is this? $43. I want to buy it so bad. I want to buy it all. I want to buy it all. Oh my gosh. I don't know if I've ever seen this before either. Pennywise Shadow Lights. Look at this. That is cool. Oh my gosh. You'll float down here. Look at that. And there goes Pennywise's face. You set this in the middle of your room and it casts all this around all the walls and the ceiling. That is awesome. I actually bought this throw from the, uh, the flagship store in New Jersey when I was there. Um, but here's a Pennywise one that I don't think I have seen before. That's pretty cool. And then I did the video of the Friday the 13th at uh, Spirit Halloween, and I don't think, actually I know for a fact that I did not see this throw there. It may have been there. I think somebody mentioned it in the background. I did see this one, but not this one. This is so totally cool. We got Pennywise in the sewer here, and he lights up. Look at that creepy face. And then we got Sam sitting on a pumpkin here. Yep, and it lights up too. That is pretty cool. Oh, somebody broke one. What in the world is this? It's like a walking stick with a baby head on top. What the <laughs> Oh my gosh, that is amazingly creepy and crazy and scary. What in the world? I can't even get over this. And it feel, like the feel of this is almost like it's supposed to be like skin wrapped around it. Maybe it's the baby's skin and there's his evil head. That thing is gonna haunt me in my nightmares tonight. Oh, look at these. I haven't spent a lot of time looking at stuff in this area when I come into the stores, but I need to. And this one just caught my eye because we have a flashing jack-o'-lantern and they're black. So that means that when you hang these up, you don't even really see the jack-o'-lanterns. I mean, at night, you just see their flashing, scary faces. What in the world? I have never seen this before. Okay, this is a uh, fog scent. Okay, where is it? Here, all right, here's the fog juice. What you do is you get you a fog machine. Get a fog machine, you get a bunch of this fog juice, and look, they actually have even bigger fog juices down here. That's an, an entire gallon. And then you can put this stuff in here to make it smell like something like pumpkin spice, cotton candy, what the heck, mildew? You want your fog to smell like mildew? Burning leaves. Holy crap, guys. I was just about to try these out, but I'm gonna pass them up because I see something that I did not know was coming. Actually, I kind of knew it was coming, but I guess it put, got put out at the New Jersey store and then taken back off the shelf. The new Halloween Kills Michael Myers mask. Oh my gosh, look at this thing. This is so cool. I love it so much. I think this is my second favorite Michael Myers mask ever. All right, how much is this guy? $69.99. It, it's weird because like, it feels more stiff. The rubber isn't as pliable as the other masks. So it keeps its shape while it's hanging here. That is so cool. That was so worth the trip to come out here to New York, guys. Holy crap, guys. All right, I gotta catch my breath. That's so cool. I'm so glad I got to see that. But let's go back over here to what we were just about to do. I just simply wanted to hear some of these guys, like this talking pumpkin door knocker. Oh no, come on now. There he is. You can knock all you want, but the bell is inside my mouth. I dare you to ring it. <laughs> <laughs> I love that guy. All right, here we got the creepy skull pathway markers. 
I love that effect. It looks like lightning. And they're screaming and being electrocuted too. Okay, we got the scary gargoyle pathway marker. Does he make sound? Okay, just looks like he's burning. Apparently there's no sound. And then we have Pennywise down here. Uh, they must be... There's no... There's no button to push. Almost this entire aisle is empty, but they have a good times doll. This guy is so awesome. All right, let's try him out. Is he gonna do something? All right, his batteries must be dead because he's not doing anything. Ah! Look at this, guys. Here we go. This is the very first Spirit Halloween that I have ever actually seen. Legit Spirit Halloween shirts. Now, these are all long sleeve and Unfortunately, none of them would fit me or else I'd buy it right now. But how cool is this? So much fun, it's scary. And that is $29.99 for anybody who wants to know. Man, if they had my size, I would buy it right now. I haven't even seen anything like that on the website, guys. So if you live in this area, get down here and get it and you'll be the only lucky person with one. All right, guys, they still have a ton of stuff to put up in here. Um, if I can manage it, I will come back to this location and we will do a much better video when everything's set up. But let's go through the chains of death and we are going to go ahead and call it a day on this one. And uh, stick around, guys, because there's plenty more coming. I can't wait. I'm so excited. I love Halloween. I told you to stay away. Oh my god! <laughs> what are those?